and welcome to your latest edition of Warwickshire Weekly News. In the news this week, Warwickshire County Council has won a Green Apple Environment Award. It honours the authority's Grey to Green Food Waste Recycling Scheme and provides international recognition for the council's green efforts. First launched in 1994, the Green Apple Awards provide annual recognition for the best international campaigns and seek out the greenest companies, councils and communities. The result is therefore a great achievement, especially as Warwickshire beat competition from 500 other nominations in the category of environmental best practice. And in other news, consumers across the county are being encouraged to know their rights this festive season. With the Black Friday slash Cyber Monday sales having taken place in the last week, anyone who has purchased goods online should be aware of their consumer rights. Warwickshire County Council's Trading Standards Service has therefore offered 10 top tips that consumers need to be aware of, such as only carrying out transactions with online retailers that are known and trusted. You can find out the rest of the services must read advice by heading to www.warwickshire.gov.uk forward slash trading standards. This coming Saturday we'll also see Warwickshire County Council teaming up with the Federation of Small Businesses to run its fourth annual Small Business Saturday. The event aims to support local independent firms with a social media guide now available for download at smallbusinesssaturdayuk.com to highlight all the local businesses taking part in 2016. And finally, the latest group of extraordinary people who had what it took to become a retained firefighter in Warwickshire were hailed in a special passing out ceremony on Saturday. Held at an Eaton fire station, the event saw the county's newest recruits showcase their skills after completing a demanding 14-day course of firefighter training. Warwickshire's Deputy Chief Fire Officer Rob Moyney was joined at the ceremony by Councillor John Horner in celebrating the efforts of these extraordinary individuals. This latest addition to the ranks means that there are now more than a hundred active retained firefighters in Warwickshire, although more are still needed. If you think you have what it takes to join them, then visit www.warwickshire.gov.uk forward slash be extraordinary to find out more. And that's all for now. Come back next week for the latest in breaking news from around the county. We'll see you then.